Okay. Kush Tri Mantra, please. Namo Vitra Rai. Namo Vitra Rai. Namo Arihantanam. Namo Arihantanam. Namo Siddhanam. Namo Siddhanam. Namo Ayariyanam. Namo Ayariyanam. Namo Vazayanam. Namo Vazayanam. Namo Loe Sava Shahunam. Namo Loe Sava Shahunam. Eso Panchanamukaro. Eso Panchanamukaro. Savapa Vakpanashanam. Savapa Vakpanashanam. Mangala Namcha Savishim. Mangala Namcha Savishim. Padamam Havai Mangalam. Padamam Havai Mangalam. Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevai. Om Namaskar. Om Namaskar. Jai Satchidana. Jai Satchidana. Okay, very good. Thank you. English uh, daily prayer. Who wants to do it? At the Sri. Okay. Oh, Dada Bhagwan. Please give me the infinite inner strength such that I never compromise on health so that my body as an instrument will always help to me in accomplishing my life goals of studies and such. I will remain absolutely sincere in studies. I will always stay away from bad company <clears throat> and bad habits. And whatever happens, please shower your divine grace and blessings such that I never ever miss my satsa. May I use my mind, speech, body, instrument, and my soul that is all my resources to oblige others, which is the best religion. I will remain sincere, more and pure in mind, speech, and body, in all my dealings with self and everyone in life, so that I become a man of personality for excellence, exactly like Dada Bhagwan. Oh, Dada Bhagwan, I further resolve to always listen to my parents and never will I ever back out for them ever get you. Please give me the internet and strength in this regard. Jai Satchidana. Very good. Study prayer. Okay, Kush. Unmute. Hey, Dada Bhagwan. I'm determined to break all the barriers, obstacles, and obstructions that come to me in studying and understanding. Please shower your divine grace and blessings. I mean, and please share divine grace and blessings. So, so, wait. Can I restart it? Yeah. Hey, Dada Bhagwan, please give me the infinite understanding. I'm determined to break all the barriers, obstacles, and obstructions that come to me in studying and understanding. Please share divine grace, break all the wheels on my vision, and give me the infinite inner strength to make my learning the best. Jai Satchidan. Yes. That means you are not repeating this daily, this prayer. Right? How many times I did you do, study? Like, how many times I got you confused. How many times you study? I do, but then I got confused with the daily prayer. Okay, the study is very important to get uh, yeah. maximum points. Okay, who knows the Tala Bhagavan prayer? It has to be. Hey Dada Bhagwan. Hey, hey Dada, Dada Bhagwan. Hum hai aapke bachche. Hum hai aapke bachche. Dil ke hai sachche. Dil ke hai sachche. sachche. Phir bhi hai kachche. Phir bhi hai kachche. Kaam karenge achche achche. Kaam karenge achche achche. Okay, very good. Okay, homework. Anybody remember what the homework was? Let's see. Um, the homework was uh, wait, sorry. The homework was three thing. Your three weaknesses and weaknesses and like three things you want to improve on, and um, the first code of conduct and where you went wrong with it. Okay. I think you are the only one who submitted the report. Go ahead. I'm sorry, hit this fee. Hit this fee also submitted it. What's that? 
Hitasvi also submitted it. Oh, <coughs> after I talked, well, she cheated. Well, the three languages she is cheated. more consistent with what prayers because, like, sometimes they vary on what time I do in the day. Um, my second one is on school day, I need to get more sleep. And third, I need to talk to more people. And um, for the, like, first code of conduct, earlier today, um, I was filming something for my um, homework. It was a speaking task. And um, mommy was talking to a friend and I got really angry at her and I talked to her in a like hurtful way and I hurt her ego. I said sorry to her and um, I helped her with that. I helped her with cleaning afterwards. Okay. That's me. So the three things I wanted to improve on was not to fight with Bhavya, listen to my parents and Dada and do exercise. So I did listen to Bhavya throughout the week and I listened to my parents and Dada and I was unable to do the exercises because I had like a lot of homework and coursework to do so I would sleep, play and then wake up like at the time I normally wake up. So what did you do wrong this week? I did not do exercise. Oh, you did not do exercise? Yes. Okay, Kush? Um, so my weaknesses are that I don't listen to my parents, so I had to try to like listen to my parents. So I, I did good in that. Um, the second one was to study. So uh, this week um, I had school and I studied. And then when I came back, I also um, studied like extra every day for like an hour. And I and the last one was like to do some exercises and like eat healthy, eat whatever my mom makes. So. Uh, whatever my mom made, I ate it, and uh, yeah. Three. I my three goals were to um listen to everyone, not get angry, and um eat everything my mom makes. So I did um listen to everyone and eat everything, but I got mad at my sister once because um I was doing something and. She came and started like um like taking my stuff that I needed, so I got mad at her. Okay, it does me. It talks about. So it's a Dylan. My first improvement was that I will be studying sincerely two hours. So today I have studied only one hour sincerely. My second goal was that I will be not do a day with my mom. But today I had to one time I die with my mom. And my third goal was that I would be wake up at six o'clock. So today I had uh, I was wake up at seven o'clock. Okay. Because I had fever. My health was not good. Are you your fever fever is gone now? Yes. Okay, very good. Today, sir. Very good. Dibak Dada? Yeah. <clears throat> First of all, I believe you people don't have your timetable at home. I have when time. you have when you have timetable, then you know where you stand, where you are going wrong, and especially I uh, I see from that angle that uh, whichever subject is poor or you are weak in that subject, then you must allocate more time at home. So when you are, uh, I mean, in your exams, you are overall good in the sense that uh, all, my, I mean, all subjects, you are like 80 plus or 90 plus, something like that. But when uh, rest of the subject, you are doing like 90 plus in four subjects, but in one subject, you are like, 40 or 50, something like that. Then you know that you have to put more work. You put, put more time in that subject. That's how it is very important for you to have Sachin, your own timetable. <clears throat> Any weak subject is like in your body, you don't, uh, uh, you have some weak portion, weak part, and that mm -hmm. will put you down. You understand? So this is where you have to, when you have your timetable, then it really helps you 
patch up or make up for your weak subject. Do you, don't you think it is important? Like um, some people are very good at math. Then for math, they don't really need to put more hours because otherwise also they are good. But let's say if like environment science, they're not good or science if they're not good, then that's how they can keep put more time. So timetable is very important. <clears throat> you, you have to have a fixed wake up time and fixed sleeping time. Just one more thing, with your, with your change of season, does your sleeping time and wake up time change? Or they remain same? Remain what same. is it? I, I don't know really. Same. I don't know. They, they, it remains same. same. Irrespective same. of uh, what time the sun rises or what time the sun sets. Right? No. Is that so? Ah, then, then you can have a fixed timetable. It will be very good for you. So it's like um, you will discipline your body naturally in the sense continuously without any break or without any change. You are sleeping at, let's say, 10 or 11, 10, let's say, 10 p.m. or 9 p.m., whatever it is, 9 p.m. and waking up at 6 a.m. It will really help you very good. Because then your body will, be, will become very efficient and it will give you a lot of uh, output. You understand? Yeah. Yeah. So that's that's how. And uh, sometimes, if you are breaking that, then it's fine. But most of the time, if this is maintained, then your body becomes very efficient. And you know, in our daily prayer, we are asking for, I mean, praying Dada to. Uh, in, on three fronts. One is health, second is study, and third is satsang. So when you are healthy, you are always available. You have good time for study and satsang. Right? And when you decide in the prayer we have said that uh, you will not miss your satsang any time come what may. Then with that, with that decision itself, it will help you connect to satsang and you will always be abreast with all the wisdom you need for your life. That's what it is. But Dipal Dada, there is one problem. What? In London, the sun doesn't rise and sun doesn't set. It's always dark in London. Muggy, dark. No, no, that's what I know, I know. I understand I'm that. That's kidding. why I'm I just asked kidding. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, well, I, I remember once when we when we went there in December, end of December, first week of January, you won't believe that in the morning after having breakfast, it, it is like uh, you have sunlight from 10.30 or so to 2.30. Is that so? Almost like this time. Maybe, so maybe. 10.30 to 2.30 and after uh, we have breakfast a little ahead of that. So when it is too dark, I mean, quite pitch dark, people say, evening, what are you going to eat? It's already dark and you don't know. It's like, so we feel that it's already night. And these people are saying, evening, what are you going to eat? That sounded very awkward, but that's what. So that time you can't help. Is, is the sun out today? Yeah, it's, it's, it's just cloudy. It's cloudy. <laughs> sun is never out there. Okay. <laughs> no, but it's like, uh, oh, yeah, sun is a problem, yes. That, problem. that is why sometimes heads is not a good mood, the sun is not out. <clears throat> okay, what happened to Kush? Kush? Where are you? Okay, last time we talked about TV. And I think, yeah. uh, what did the last time Deepak Dada say about TV? Anybody? Let's see. Let us see. He said it's not going to help you in any way. I mean, it's just entertainment. So you can like use that time to read books or play something instead of watching TV. 
But what is the greatest damage it does to your body? And where? Kush? It hurts your eyes. Does what? It hurts your eyes. Okay. That's one part. What's the major damage? Your knowledge. Because you're just busy looking, so you don't get to where process is no, anything. Where is knowledge stored? In the brain. In the brain. Where in the brain? Your chit. Hmm? Your chit. Where in the brain? This is all brain. Where? What part? <laughs> where is it stored? Your mind. Who said that? Yes. That's it. That's the right answer. And what's the function of the mind? <clears throat> how like our thoughts and what we do it does what it controls our thoughts and what we do okay anything else suppose you didn't have any mind what will happen to you have you ever thought about this? if you don't have intellect what we call buddhi what will happen to you have you thought about that Kush, who else, who else watches TV? I know Hitakshi Ben Hitakshi Bhai does know. What do you, what do you what do you watch that's week? I I like I watch um I mainly watch with Bhavya. Otherwise, I just watch one of like seasons that my friends say they like. Oh, watch this! It's very interesting, and that's so I watch it. What's and that? Then, a show or what? Yeah, like a series, yeah. Series. That's even the worst. What about you, Hatsi? If Kashalia puts the TV on and she's watching whatever she watches, sometimes I'll sit there and watch it with her. Otherwise, I don't really watch TV. No, no, but what does uh, Kushalia uh, watch? Um, do you know this game called Minecraft? Oh, it's something, it's a, to, yeah. something to screw up your mind or improve your mind? Yeah, yeah. It's, we, we tell Kashali it's not good for her, but she doesn't listen. So sometimes mm -hmm. mommy and papa will tell me to go sit while Kashali is watching it to see if what she's watching is appropriate. So it's trying to brainwash your uh, thinking or try to reinforce yeah, some. Kashali doesn't listen. See? This is very dangerous. This see? is very dangerous. Yeah, At see? this age. Okay, Tibagan, let's talk about it because they don't seem to understand the real damage which causes okay, first... like especially uh, just a moment, like Kushali watching this. You know, they're going to impress on her mind to do this, this, this. And then all this uh, Dada's gnad and all this stuff, Mama, Papa saying will not guys get into the brain or head. Because they, they're programming us to be like ro robots for the future. So we don't think and we think from them. Okay, Dipurdara? Yeah, the first first thing is like uh, uh, the chit or what you call as the reflective consciousness is the king of our body. And <clears throat> Any any task, if you want to finish and finish it successfully, then you must have a focused work. But when that focus is broken, which happens if your focus is interrupted, like uh, you want to watch, uh, you want to see your phone, or certain thing just pops up in your mind, what you have seen on, on TV, which happens. So uh, it doesn't help you focus and that really damages your reflective in uh, reflective consciousness power, that is chitta power. 
And whatever we read, whatever we study, whatever we see, the, the picture or the image of that understanding or that particular picture is stored in the chit. And when someone asks you, then the chit shows you. And that's how we come to know and we, we uh, what do you say, like we reproduce it back. Like this is what is the answer or like that. But when, when people, we watch television or phone, then it, it's just, just imagine that if you're studying and there are other new, you think of your phone and you will check your mail or check your messages, something like that, which is not good because whatever you are doing, uh, the focus breaks, that continuity is lost. And when such continuity is lost, then that power to register, to know, to understand that really gets down. Very dangerous, very dangerous. And you know how they measure? They measure through viewership. That is number of people who visited or viewed the program. And they want to increase that. So we must be very wise in choosing what we watch on television. And if it is entertainment, my God, you better restrict your time or totally avoid it. Because nowadays this entertainment level has gone to such a such a point, they just hold you till the end. And then even when it is over, you are very keen in knowing what has happened next in those future episodes. They make it very spicy, very interesting, very touchy, emotional at the same time, very much uh, technology wise also they show things like that. So that is where you have to be very careful. And this time, especially this time, I will say your young age, the growing age, wherein you have to really learn. And it is very important that you learn with well focused attention, that attention is lost. I will say that we were very fortunate that during our time, these gadgets were not there. So in all our free times, in all our free times, we used to play or did something more physical than using our senses like television or radio or not radio or not television, uh, what do you say, phone. So make it a point that at, at least during your study time, avoid all these gadgets as far as possible. And if you want to test yourself, check for yourself that, okay, uh, these three months I will not watch, I'll really minimize it and see, check your results, how it has come. How are you performing in your exam? I'm very sure that your improvement, your progress will be drastic because it really snatches away our inner power. So think of it and try doing an experiment. This time we are doing it at the 9 p.m. satsang. We are persuading kids not to watch television for next two or three months until their final exams are not over. And it will be a great, uh, I will say, experimentation on our side that without watching TV, without watching phone, I mean, you changed my sheets. The phone, then you really, <laughs> then you really don't, uh, uh, your, your, your success will be great. Your performance will be fantastic. And one more thing I have observed for my case, I mean, I just want to reveal that, that, you know, when I used to travel outside India and during that time, we did not have much opportunity to watch television or uh, even listen to the news. At least for the news factor, uh, we would watch television or even we will uh, go through the newspaper. And so uh, I'm not boasting, but now it is more than five to eight years. I haven't seen any newspaper, not on television, not on phone, not a physical copy, hard copy. 
and I'm doing fine. So do you read newspaper? Anyway, is what? Do you read newspaper? No, no time. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm not. I'm, I'm, I'm surprised. I'm, I'm not. Surpri I mean, uh, I'm not missing any news. I I don't miss anything. <laughs> Yeah, and if there is something very important, every other person will bombard you with that information. So that's how you better think. Yes, and it was. Make it a point, try to do this experimentation for one semester, I will say, and check for yourself. Instead, yes, I'm not saying in your free time, make it useful, play some games, but not on the gadgets, not on the gadgets. Play any physical game, any physical game, whatever is suitable to you. We have said in the, in the 9 p.m., because now they cannot go out also because of the COVID thing, they must use the rope skipping. It's a wonderful exercise. They make you really strong. And of course, then other games also. Right? So think about it. Jay Sachitana. Jay Sachitana. Oh, and for you, two big mamas, Vitasvi and uh, Etsy, uh, this watch that, you know, when Kosales of various time is coming. Oh, yes, that, that I, I missed. I missed that point. Sorry. It is very dangerous. And don't let her watch. Because I know in Germany, there are rules that kids, if they are not supposed to watch certain program, they cannot. They cannot. There is no way that they can watch those programs. Totally banned. And uh, what, what do you call the child? It's called something. Something you said. What is it called? Child. Yeah, you can, so it's a certain uh, block there. Yes. So the, it, when the child control mode, only certain channels are only visible. Others, they cannot watch. And they can they can make a you or cry. No. No way, they cannot watch, period. This is the ruling of the government. So if government thinks that way, family and individual family people, they must think very seriously. Don't you think so? I'm surprised and at the same time, I'm very afraid also that how uh, at home, and mama is what? Mama is uh, the primary teacher, you see? How she allows Kushali to watch all these things? Huh? Mommy doesn't allow Kushali. Kushali just doesn't listen to mommy. Really? How is it possible? We had no choice. There's no way we cannot we cannot say I, I cannot listen, I don't listen. No way. You have to listen. <laughs> Can you think of that? Dandi, Danda. Yes, yes, yes. We were so notorious, mischievous guys, but we were totally silent in front of our dad and mom. I'm not joking. I was a terror. My mom is here. I'm going to ask her. <laughs> terror. Every day, serious complaint from surrounding people, locality where we would play and do a lot of mischief. But this is one. But we cannot... Uh, you cannot have our own choice, at least like this. Do you understand? Let's see. Ah, Jai Sachidana. Jai Sachidana. Also, you watch uh, like uh, Bhavya and... Kush and Hitlasi, when their show wants to come, they'll automatically go and switch around, tell you to sit with you. Just click it already built in their mind. So where, what is the focus? Then? Just fr fracturing the focus that they put, as I say, you know, that happens. That's like your Tarak Meta. You know exactly what time is coming. And your brain will already, whatever you are doing, push. Say, ha, Tarat Mehta, and you'll drop everything. Whether you're studying or you're, no, like, you're listening. No, that, in that, you can watch it anytime. Is what? 
it, it's in that you can watch it anytime. There's not like a special no, time. Whatever, coming. whatever. Your brain will say, "Oh, oh, time for uh, Tarak Mehta." You'll drop everything. Studying, Mama talking, Papa talking, all disappear. That is the fracture of the focus of uh, chit. Okay, you just do an experiment. Look at that. Okay. So and if, try for two, three months and check for yourself what is the outcome. Then I believe you will make your, your life decision yeah. that they are just fooling you. Really. Yeah. For example, <laughs> Hattasvi and Hilsev, Bhavya or uh, Sally wants to say, hey, let's watch some old satsang, junior, junior satsang and see if you remember what we learned from there. Something like that. You know, play games like that. You know, and uh, there hey, are so you... many. Those games are also they're very uh, educative games. Previously, we were we not we were, we were playing with that only. Anyway, so this is it. Think about it and try an experimentation and check for yourself. Yeah, do whatever you think is best for you. We just here to point <laughs> things because. You know, we are learning this about this on and on and on and on. And they, they do confess. TV is there to change your brain, change your thinking, change your beliefs. That's what they're there. Because they want you to buy certain things. They want you to buy certain yes. clothes, certain food. Um, and goes on and on and on. They're playing havoc with our brain. Very dangerous. It is called propaganda. Hello? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Why everybody is serious? I don't know. I was also wondering. Huh? Let's see. That's why you're serious. Um, this this is my listening face. <laughs> I was listening to what you were saying. Ah, okay. So, uh, uh, did, did, uh, what the the big size make any sense? Yeah. So think about it, okay? <laughs> the dadagnan is to think, okay? Uh, especially in today's time, they have made this phone and TV very, very complicated and alluring for you. every every age people. I remember uh, the the youth of our time. I mean, when we used to go to uh, Satsang for, in America and UK, I I used to see in all the free time some or the other game they'll take the ball and go out and start playing basketball. Even if it is 10 minutes, then uh, it's snowing outside and you start saying that. That's what it does. Okay. But nowadays you don't see that. They just uh, sit and start watching TV or the mobile phone. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's time is up, uh, but uh, we'll continue with the homework. But please, 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 please. Write a journal, okay? Because you always take today's example, and that's it. Okay. Column number one is life and bread with us all the time. So please write a journal every day before you go to sleep. Mind, speech, and body. Remember, these are the three culprits. So think about what the mind did on hurt somebody, some thoughts, some players, friends. Okay? Body. Yeah. Your action with Bhavya or parents or whatever. That Yeah, Jack, just 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 one minute. Jack, how how is your mind responding to different situations? See, it's like, with the time I get thought, I must go to eat. So 
how our mind plays a vital role of in our life and imagine if there is no mind what happens what will happen that i said you become absent minded and absent minded people means they don't know the surrounding situation and they are out of it like do you understand they are totally unaware of the situation because as per the surrounding whatever wherever we are we get those thoughts and that's how we respond but if you don't get any thought then looking at people you will not have any emotion also very emotions are because of our mind do you understand think about it and analyze your mind it will be a good exercise Then you have free time. Then what? Uh, what kind of thought you get? I will watch television and watch phone. I you have choice to play. You have the choice to play something, or you have to you have choice to go to sleep. So think and see, analyze what is happening. Yes, uh, Achyuta. You know, you know the function of brain. Anybody? I mean, do you mean hey, what is the function of mind? It processes. Is what? What we it processes what we see and hear, and then like tells us how to respond no, seeing, to it. See, seeing is a uh, eyes only. Like it helps us think. Do you ever get thoughts? You know what yeah. thoughts are. Yeah. <laughs> we have to go fundamentals. What is the thought? Yeah, yeah, it will be very interesting. I'm saying just like when we look at Itashri, let's say, when I see her, then immediately my mind identifies her. Oh, she's Itashri, Ankit Bai's daughter, and so and so, so and so from London. While well, she was in India for a while, now she's in. Then back. Do you understand? But you are not. Whatever we are seeing outside, we are getting the picture inside, and based on that memory, like if you if some new person comes, then I have no memory of that or no information of that person. Then I don't know. I ask who is this person from where, what what he or she is doing, and then once I get that information, then my brain will start working. Oh, I know. Him or her, uh, uh, he or she was there in the last session, and we talked this, that. Do you understand? So that's how our brain is working. Very interesting. Okay. Okay. This like uh, I want to do something that comes in the mind. That's a thought. You know, I want to eat. That comes in the mind. You know. I want to be with Kuchali. That comes in the mind. So that's the thought, you know. So let's just start looking at the, uh, what comes in the uh, mind. Mind, mind is here. Okay. Here is the mind, and that's all the thoughts come here. But we are sitting. Oh, I, I'm bored. Where does it come from? From the mind. Okay, everybody got it. Yeah. So let's uh, let's start looking at the mind and what it does. It plays havoc with our life. Keep keep track of your mind. <laughs> I try to keep yeah. you in line. Okay, okay. Uh, anyway, okay. Dhruvi, can you do three mantra, please? Namo Vihamta Nam. Namo Arihamta Nam. Namo Siddhana. Namo Siddhana. Namo Ayurvyana. Namo Ayurvyana. Namo Vajrayana. Namo Vajrayana. Namo Loe Sava Shahuna. Namo Loe Sava Shahuna. Eso Panchena Mukkaga. 
एसो पंचल मुखारो सर्वपावक पनाशनो मंगलानम च सवेशिम परमम हवाई मंगलम परमम हवाई मंगलम ओम नमो भगवते वासुदेवाय ओम नमो भगवते वासुदेवाय ओम नमः शिवाय ओम नमः शिवाय जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद